Hey YNR fans, The Young and the Restless, a beloved television series, recently celebrated its remarkable 50th anniversary in March of this year. For five decades, the captivating residents of Genoa City have enthralled audiences with their passionate romances and captivating mysteries. Despite the staggering number of over 12,000 episodes, numerous dedicated fans proudly claim to have watched each and every one. As we delve into the world of the young and the restless, let's explore 11 intriguing facts about the show that may only be familiar to the most devoted enthusiasts. The Innocent Years Before assuming the title of the young and the restless, the show almost had a different name. Originally referred to as The Innocent Years, CBS executives aimed to introduce a youth-oriented daytime series to rival other vibrant soap operas on ABC like All My Children, One Life to Live, and General Hospital. However, the show's creators, William J. Bell and Lee Philip Bell, opted for a different name. They believed that the innocence of young America had been lost, prompting them to rename the series The Young and the Restless which better encapsulated the youth and prevalent sentiments of the early 1970s. Genoa City Beckons If you've ever wondered what it would be like to visit the picture ski Genoa City depicted on screen, you can make your way there. The small town of Genoa City, located in Wisconsin, actually exists. However, it may not live to the glamorous portrayal seen on the show. William and Lee Philip Bell named the fictional setting after the real Genoa City as they often drove through it during their weekend trips from Chicago to their summer home in Lake Geneva, Wisconsin. The actual Genoa City, situated along US Route 12, is a modest community with a population of 3,042. Interestingly, it derived its name from Genoa, New York, which in turn was named after the Italian city of Genoa. Unconventional Sibling Romance Let's delve into some intriguing facts about the show's most unconventional storylines. Did you know that two real-life siblings played romantic partners on The Young and the Restless? Heather and David Tom, who are siblings in real life, portrayed Victoria Newman and Billy Abbott respectively during a period spanning nine years. Although their characters embarked on a complex romantic journey, the storyline only developed after Heather departed from the show in 2003. When Victoria returned from Italy in 2005, Amelia Henley assumed the role and embarked on secretive romance with Billy Avid, then played by Billy Miller. Jean Cooper's Iconic Plastic Surgery Storyline Late actress Jean Cooper, known for her portrayal of the iconic Catherine Chancellor, captivated audiences from 1973 until her passing in 2013. In 1984, she made television history by incorporating her real-life facelift into the show's plot. Just as Cooper underwent the actual procedure, the character Catherine underwent the same surgery, with Cooper's transformation filmed and featured on the show. Thousands of fans watched with anticipation as the bandages were removed, revealing Cooper's refreshed appearance. This pivotal moment paved the way for many individuals to consider reconstructive surgery and enhance their own appearances. Cooper's enduring contribution to the soap opera world earned her a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame in 1993, making her the first daytime soap star to receive this prestigious honor. Sadly, she passed away at the age of 84 with her final episode of airing five days before her death. The Dethroning of a Champion In its early days, The Young and the Restless aired half-an-hour episodes. As the show gained popularity, CBS pressured William Bell to extend the episodes to one hour. However, this decision led to a decline in the show's number one ranking in ratings. According to Bell's account in his book, Worlds Without End, the art and history of the soap opera, it took three years for the show to reclaim its number one status. In the process, some main cast members, particularly those from the popular families like the Brooks and Fosters, departed due to the unexpected shift to one-hour episodes not specified in their contracts. Bell shared his resolve in the book, 
stating that if any more actors from these families chose to leave, he would take the radical action. A risky rebirth Following careful revaluation of the remaining cast, Bell noticed that two characters, Paul Williams and Jack Abbott, had relatively minor roles on the show. Against the advice of CBS's head of daytime, Bell chose to revamp the series by building new families around these characters. His bold decision paid off immensely as the audience wholeheartedly embraced the new families, leading to renewed interest in the show. A Lasting Legacy The Young and the Restless continues to enthrall audiences, with no signs of fading away. In early 2020, CBS and Sony Pictures Television reached an agreement to extend the show for an additional four seasons, ensuring its presence in the daytime schedule until the 2023-2024 broadcast season. As we celebrate the incredible milestone of the Young and the Restless 50th anniversary, these fascinating facts serve as a testament to the enduring impact of this beloved soap opera. The show's ability to capture the hearts of viewers and evolve with the times has solidified its place in television history, ensuring its enduring legacy for generations to come. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notification for our channel. That way, you'll never miss a new video and be among the first to know when we post. We're always posting fresh news and we don't want you to miss out. So be sure to subscribe and turn on notification now.